Greetings, my fellow proclaimers. This is your guide to effective proclamation of the Sunday readings. Remember, one slash means a short pause. Two slashes mean a longer pause with your tone going down for a period, exclamation point, and information questions. Your tone should go up at the end for questions with yes or no answer. Red underline suggests emphasis or stress and slowing of pace. Yellow line suggests eye contact or looking at the assembly. Now, let's try with the Sunday readings of July 7, the 14th Sunday in Ordinary Time. A reading from the book of the prophet Isaiah. Thus says the Lord, Rejoice with Jerusalem and be glad because of her, all you who love her. Exalt, exalt with her, all you who are mourning over her. Oh, that you may suck fully of the milk of her comfort, that you may nurse with delight at her abundant breasts. For thus says the Lord, Lo, I will spread prosperity over Jerusalem like a river, and the wealth of the nations like an overflowing torrent. As nurslings, you shall be carried in her arms and fondled in her lap. As a mother comforts her child, so will I comfort you. In Jerusalem, you shall find your comfort. When you see this, your heart shall rejoice, and your bodies flourish like the grass. The Lord's power shall be known to his servants. The word of the Lord. Second reading. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Galatians. Brothers and sisters, May I never boast except in the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ, through which the world has been crucified to me and I to the world. For neither does circumcision mean anything, nor does incircumcision, but only a new creation. Peace and mercy be to all who follow this rule and to the Israel of God. From now on, let no one make troubles for me, for I bear the marks of Jesus on my body. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with your spirit, brothers and sisters. Amen. The Word of the Lord. Thank you, brothers and sisters, for allowing me to be of help. Please read and reread as often as possible and get familiar with the text. Then you can read effectively and with confidence from the lectionary. Good luck and God bless. Guide to July 14 readings will be next week. Until then, goodbye.